Hello and welcome to my bioinformatics tutorial series. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the application uh, or the software ORF Finder to locate open reading frames in a given DNA sequence. Okay, uh, we go uh, to Google and uh, we write ORF Finder and we hit enter. Uh, the URF Finder is a software located or hosted on the ADCBI website. So uh, we click on the first hit. This is uh, our software. Uh, they say here that uh, the URF Finder or the Open Reading Frame Finder is a graphical analysis tool uh, which finds uh, all open reading frames or uh, possible coding uh, regions. Okay, uh, you should know that uh, this uh, software is a very basic software. So, uh, in this uh, tutorial, I'm gonna use uh, microbial sequence, which is a sequence from a uh, bacteria's genome, because uh, the higher organisms have uh, very complex genes. So, I have already sequence here past our sequence. Uh, in this uh, option of uh, genetic codes we can uh, select uh, different uh, methods of uh, finding uh, ORFs. Uh, for example here uh, we can uh, select uh, the yeast mitochondrial or invertebrate uh, uh, mitochondrial but uh, I'm gonna stick with the standard option click uh, here on this button ORF find and you wait a little okay this is uh, our result page uh, we can see here uh, the all uh, possible six uh, reading frames in our sequence one two three four five six uh, we can see uh, also that uh, the plus one the plus two and the plus three are uh, the strands and the minus one, minus two, and minus three are uh, the negative strands. Uh, to see uh, an open reading frame, uh, for example, uh, here, uh, we click on the green uh, rectangle here. It will uh, turn uh, to purple. And uh, you can see here that uh, the length is uh, 355th amino acid. Uh, the start codon, which is ATG, and the stop codon, which is TAA. This is uh, our sequence. We can see also that uh, it selects uh, here uh, the plus one uh, strand and the length uh, of uh, bases and the position from uh, what base to what base. Okay, we can uh, clip, uh, click uh, accept if we accept uh, this uh, open reading frame as a coding region. Uh, we have uh, this uh, option here, which uh, you can select uh, from blast B or T blast N. For, uh, for, uh, you can uh, blast uh, this uh, sequence against the uh, database using uh, the blast B for protein and uh, the T plus N for uh, nucleotide sequence. Uh, we can select here the type of uh, database. Uh, for example, here is uh, the non-redundant uh, database. And you click on blast. It will uh, show us uh, the matches uh, to our uh, open reading frame. Okay, uh, this is uh, all uh, for uh, today's tutorial. And I uh, remind you that uh, this uh, software is very basic, so uh, don't, uh, you, uh, don't use it uh, a lot uh, for uh, complex uh, genes of uh, higher organisms, because uh, it's not uh, that accurate. Uh, this is uh, all uh, for today. Uh, for more uh, information about uh, bioinformatics and bioinformatics tutorials, you can visit my uh, blog at bioinformatics-made-easy.blogspot.com Thanks for listening.